So hello everyone, myself Dr. Pooja, your own physiology faculty at Cerebellum. And today we are having Dr. Devadarshan with us who got, who got uh, INICT in uh, 222 rank in this uh, uh, attempt. And congratulations, Dr. Devadarshan. How are you Thank feeling you. right now? Um, I was not expecting this rank, ma'am. When I got this rank, I was uh, surprised, ma'am. All right. So congratulations once again. And tell me, uh, what was your story? Like, uh, it was your internship while attempt or you have given special time for the preparation. How was it and how you started preparing? Um, I started my preparation after uh, internship only, ma'am. Uh, means, I, uh, first I started with the BTR. Then uh, uh, after doing BTR, I was getting around 140 corrects, ma'am, in GTs. Then uh, in the November uh, in set, I got around uh, 2,800, ma'am. Then and uh, I worked on the parts where I am weak from the main videos, ma'am. That I improved uh, gradually with practice with uh, English, ma'am. So uh, from internship onward, you uh, started preparing and uh, from the BTR... No, no, after the internship. After the internship only, I started the After the internship. Now. All right. So uh, tell me from where you have done your MBBS, how was you uh, as a student in the MBBS and were you very studious or you are fun loving also? How was your MBBS story? I was an uh, average student in the MBBS, ma'am. I did my MBBS, ma'am, Government Stanley Medical College, Chennai, ma'am. And, uh, and the internship there was uh, somewhat hectic. So I uh, started after that only. So what are the um, GTs for GTs? Do you use to have a cerebellum resource or you use to follow that late night PYQ also or other uh, ENDs also that we have? For GTs, uh, uh, first I used to stick to uh, cerebellum, ma'am. Uh, then at the end of the preparation, we used to... Uh, do GTs in every platform available, ma'am, to mm -hmm. avoid the bias. Uh, then uh, uh, for the late night uh, PVQs, help me to. Uh, I was not doing that in live session, ma'am, but it helped me to uh, help me in developing the consistency. All right. So, uh, what was your strategy? Let's say one month before or two weeks before the exams. Yes, ma'am. Uh, the number in uh, uh, the one thing that I did wrong is I lo lost my confidence just one month before the exam, ma'am. And uh, I made many, uh, due to the lack of confidence itself, I made many silly mistakes. And uh, this time I made sure that I shouldn't repeat that. So in the last month, uh, I didn't try anything new, ma'am. Uh, what I did was I just... Uh, revised again and again what I already studied and uh, in the last seven days is all about developing confidence just to stand in front of the mirror and give positive affirmation that I will do it I can and at the end of and the, in the egg and it uh, the three hours the exam day the three hours is uh, what matters most and at that time don't think about any result or just Think of the question and uh, just give an answer. Move on. All right. So that is your strategy. Just focus on the question and whatever other thoughts that are there, just avoid those for at least three hours. Right. So tell me, uh, how are you uh, feeling right now after getting ranked? That was it worth it? Everything that you have uh, you know, done throughout the years? Yes, ma'am. I didn't expect this rank, ma'am. And uh, uh, even without without BTR, I wouldn't have ima means uh, imagined to get into a central institute, ma'am. All right, I'll definitely know. Uh, I'll let you know, ma'am, uh, Zainab, ma'am, that right? You have said that, and uh, your regards also. Tell me, what is your favorite branch? What are you planning for? I am planning to take uh, emergency medicine, ma'am. All right. So you belong to. I belong to Kanya, uh, means, uh, Kanya Kumari, ma'am, Tamil Nadu. So, uh, will you be preferring uh, the uh, aims there only in your area? You want to serve? No, uh, I will be 
No, ma'am. I will prefer the best college available, ma'am. All right, all right. So that is your plan for emergency medicine. How you develop love for the emergency medicine? Like when you decided that I wanted to go for it. Um, in uh, internship itself, in our casualty is quite hectic, and uh, I was something. Uh, it gives me a thrill. Like uh, I was not interested in the follow up. Like the uh, tough the thing, ma'am. And emergency medicine gives uh, it's an means we will be knowing about ev everything, ma'am. Something at least emergency cases of everything, ma'am. Even from half tall E N D, from pediatric to geriat geriatric cases, we will know at least the must to know from everything. All right. So, any last uh, advice from your side to your juniors, whomsoever is watching this interview? Uh. stick to one resource and uh, at the end of uh, the, in the last one month just it's all about building confidence and if they are stressed what should they do they are stressed it will be better to have something as a hobby if you going to gym or just spending 30 minutes of anything what they love would all be right better. and as you said the positive affirmation that will definitely uh, help them out right that's right Yes so uh, thank you very much for uh, your such a nice interview over here right and all the very thank best you. that uh, i i wish that you get uh, whatever branch you want and whatever college you want in right and definitely we will be seeing you in the cerebral hum uh, felicitation ceremony right yes ma'am sure right. congratulations once again and all the very best thank you ma'am thank you